Cola? Energy drinks? Fizz, 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 fizzy drinks? Do we even know what's in them and what they're doing to us? Spice the can. The can. Okay, here's the science part. A standard can of cola is 40 grams of sugar. The recommended limit of sugar is 30 grams. So this one can of cola is already 30% over your daily limit. Read the small print. This energy drink states on the back that there is 31 grams of sugar in a 250 milliliter serving. I smell a rat. However, the bottle actually contains 500 milliliters, which is equal to 62 grams of sugar. Who drinks half the bottle anyway? So be sure to check portion sizes. Well, what is so bad about that, you might say? Well, the proven long-term effects are tooth decay, weight gain, heart disease, type 2 diabetes, energy crashes, especially with drinks that contain caffeine. Is it fashionable to drink energy drinks? Yes. Yep. Is it fashionable to have teeth like this? No. <laughs> so, we can't drink sugary drinks. Well then, what can we have? Um, juices, fruit juices. Be careful, even fruit juice can have sugar in it. Well, we can have milk, tea, and no added sugar drinks. The best thing I find to quench my thirst is a little something, you may have heard of it. H2O, commonly known as water. Ah, that's the stuff. If you think water's boring, why don't you jazz it up with some new crazy waves, just like these. Say goodbye sugar overloading and say hello to a healthier, fresher you. Bye bye sugar, you crazy fool!